anyone here? Aaron Lichen is my son, and I wanted to... Hi, Derek. You. <laughs> I bet you never thought you'd see me again. How did you... Get out. A lot of time, pain, and effort. So much time lost because of you and Garte. That was an accident. Oh, please, don't try to save your tail now. What was done was no accident. Besides, you should be thanking me. After everything you've done, I still put my pride aside to help Aaron recover. Stay away from everyone, or so help me, I'll make sure everyone knows you're... No, you won't. You're going to stay quiet like a good boy. Unless you want your son to get involved. Oh, and Derek. I cannot wait until the wedding. We are all going to be one big happy family together. <laughs> I'm going to make a mistake. I just want to feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out, so... Hey, Aaron. Oh, uh, hey, Silvana. I heard you finished your therapy. That's awesome to hear. <laughs> Thanks. How are you doing? I'm doing a lot better. But sometimes I still feel sharp pains in my scars. But that only happens every once in a while. Y yeah uh. I still can't believe you were a werewolf this whole time. Yeah. Aaron... I have a question for you. Hmm? I, I know this might be personal, but... Afma told me everything. Everything that happened at the lodge. I asked her about it. She needed someone to vent to throughout her year alone without you, and... I did my best to lend her an ear without fear of anyone finding out what you were. B but... There was one thing I was curious about. Something that boggles my mind. What happened to you after you fell from the cliff? I was dreaming. I was remembering my life. W why did you get back up? Uh huh? From what I was told, it sounds like you were in a terrible situation. One that a normal person would probably not have come back from. The fact that it took more than a year to recover, and you're still recovering to this day, it boggles my mind at how you managed to survive. I kept thinking about her and how much she meant to me. Huh? Throughout my life, Afmal has saved me from things that I feared the most. Being different, being alone, being afraid of who I am. I still struggle with those things. These wounds, they won't heal easily. I remember how she looked at me, how she cared about me, and how in those moments, back in those mountains, how she needed me. It didn't matter what happened to me. All that mattered was getting her back to who she was. The person that I came to know. You love her in a way I'll never know. Huh? Erin, when I first met you, I hated you. For reasons I now realize were completely selfish, childish. Childish. 
out of everyone in Athma's life. I hated you the most. The way she looked at you made me fear losing my baby. Aaron, I I'm sorry. For what? The way I acted towards you in the past. I'm sorry. Silvana, you were just trying to protect her. I understand. I'm having emotions right now, Aaron! Let me feel things! <laughs> okay. Go on, then. I was always afraid of losing my baby. She was the only love I had. I wanted nothing but the best for her. The way she looked at you growing up. I knew that look. I just didn't want you to be a pretty picture. I was afraid of her falling for someone who didn't let her love them. Who never made her feel special. But now I see there is no one better for her. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It took me this long to realize it. You're not afraid of me being an Ultima? I trust you, Eren. And I know that you're planning on asking her to get married. Does everyone know? <laughs> she... Doesn't know. Oh, good. But, Aaron, even before you ask her to be with you, just know that I consider you my son. Even if things don't work out, you've earned my love and respect. Savannah, thank you. Churros! And the sentimental moment is ruined by churros. <laughs> ruined or made better? Hmm. Actually, you're right. Made better. Shall we? After you. Maybe... I have someone like Aaron in my life. Spend my coin for sure. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. I'm gonna skip my breaks. I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive.